Finding only the smallest possible life form in the infinite universe would be humankind's biggest achievement. With the infinite amount of stars in the observable universe, you would almost find it impossible to not believe there is more than us. Are we alone in the universe? No one knows for sure. Current estimates suggests that there are 200 trillion galaxies in the observable universe. The Milky Way alone contains 400 billion stars, and at least that many planets. Based on the latest data, there are at least 10 times more galaxies than previous thought before in an average galaxy. This means there could be as many as 200 quintillion stars in the observable universe. As for life as we know it, the first requirement is a universe with suitable molecular building blocks. This would mean that main molecules such as carbon, oxygen and hydrogen should be available. Scientists have already calculated that there could be around 40 billion Earth-sized planets in the total universe, but there is more needed when it comes to the ingredients for life. For life as we know it on Earth, a planet should have a rocky surface instead of being built out of gas. Most complex life forms we know are not resistant to the hot gases on planets like Saturn or Jupiter. Next to that, it will be important for the planet to have the right temperature, which is caused by the right distance from its nearby star. A too cold or too hot planet won't make it possible for Earth-like life forms to survive. Furthermore, the planet should consist of some form of magnetic field or atmosphere to protect the planet from space radiation. The size of a planet can determine its magnetic field, but is not an independent factor. Last, but not least will be the presence of water. Without any water or the possibility to make water on a planet, it will not be possible for life to sustain. With these called, ingredients for life, scientists have already discovered some potential planets that could be the home of extraterrestrial human-like species. One of these planets is Kepler-62f, which is about 1,200 light-years away from Earth and is 40% larger than Earth. Also is Kepler-62f in the inner hospitable zone from its star, and completes a full revolution around its host star in about 267 days. Another planet that is in an hospitable zone is Kepler-62e, which is located in the same five-star planet system as Kepler-62f. It is 60% larger than Earth and orbits every 122 days. Next to that is Proxima Centauri b, for which NASA already plans to launch Discovery probes in search for biosignatures. The planet is part of the Alpha Centauri star system, which is the closest star system located to our own. Not only is Proxima Centauri b Earth-sized, but there could potentially be liquid water on this planet because of the ideal distance from its host star. So on the question about if we are alone in the universe, just imagine taking a bucket of water out of the Atlantic Ocean, and say there is no fish inside. The unimaginable size of just the observable universe will never reveal all of its secrets.